Hello everyone, welcome back to the real-time game time let's play. I'm Scott Bloom, and I am still playing Mass Effect for the Xbox 360. Okay, so Eden Prime has been taken care of. Uh, one of our crew members perished. Alright, so... Right now... So let's go talk to Caden. Commander, I'm glad to see you're okay. Losing Jenkins was hard on the crew, and I'm glad we didn't lose you, too. Uh, that's good to know. Yeah, I wish I could have done something to save him. I was there. You did everything right. It was just bad luck. <laughs> it's been a hell of a shakedown, Cruz. Our first mission ends with one Spectre killing another. The Citadel Council's not going to be happy about that. Probably use it to lever more concessions out of the Alliance. Whatever's going on, the captain can handle it. Absolutely, Commander. Anything else before we head ashore? We're headed for the Citadel. When we get done with business, you and I should work out a liberty rotation. Some of the crew could use it, Commander. Alright, so... Let's... Open that up. Shotgun. Another shotgun. And an assault rifle. Sweet! Uh, I gotta go upstairs. <laughs> upstairs, talk to Joker. Nope. <laughs> uh, okay, that's that. Gotta go this way. Open, I say. Anything I can check out before talking to him? Nope. Alright. Good timing, Commander. I was just about to bring us into the Citadel. See that taxpayer money at work. Wonderful Citadel. Look at the size of that ship. The Ascension, flagship of the Citadel fleet. Well, size isn't everything. Why so touchy, Joker? I'm just saying you need firepower, too. Look at that monster. Its main gun could rip through the barriers in any ship in the Alliance fleet. Good thing it's on our side, then. Citadel Control, this is SSV Normandy, requesting permission to land. Stand by for clearance, Normandy. Clearance granted. You may begin your approach. Transferring you to an Alliance operator. Roger, Alliance Tower. Normandy out. Normandy, this is Alliance Tower. Please proceed to dock 422. This is an outrage! The Council would step in if the Geth attacked a Turian colony! The Turians don't found colonies on the borders of the Terminus systems, Ambassador. Humanity was well aware of the risks when you went into the Traverse. What about Seren? You can't just ignore a rogue Spectre. I demand action! <laughs> you don't get to make demands of the Council, Ambassador. Citadel Security is investigating your charges against Seren. We will discuss the CSEC findings at the hearing, not before. <laughs> Politics. Captain Anderson, I see you brought half your crew with you. Just the ground team from Eden Prime, in case you had any questions. I have the mission reports. I assume they're accurate? They are. Sounds like you convinced the Council to give us an audience. They were not happy about it. Seren's their top agent. They don't like him being accused of treason. 
Saren's a threat to every human colony out there. He needs to be stopped. The Council has to listen to us. Settle down, Commander. You've already done more than enough to jeopardize your candidacy for the Spectres. Mm -hmm. The mission on Eden Prime was a chance to prove you could get the job done. Instead, Nihilus ended up dead and the beacon was destroyed. That's Saren's fault, not hers. Then we better hope the CSEC investigation turns up evidence to support our accusations. Otherwise, the Council might use this as an excuse to keep you out of the Spectres. Come with me, Captain. I want to go over a few things before the hearing. Shepard, you and the others can meet us at the Citadel Tower, top level. I'll make sure you have clearance to get in. And that's why I hate politicians. Yep, couldn't agree more. Okay, hmm. easy XP. <coughs> More easy XP. Hello there, human. Sincere apology, but I am here on business and cannot be distracted right now. Hmm. You seem distressed. Is there something I can do to help? Alarmed response. You overheard that, did you? This is all going so wrong, and it is the Asari consort's fault. <laughs> She's the one who started all. What did this Asari do to get you so upset? I cannot speak more about this problem. It is too sensitive. Suffice it to say, she has compromised my authority as a diplomat. Where can I find this Asari consort? She is across the bridge from here. Her offices are easy enough to spot. Good day, human. Well, let's try to fix this problem. One of the many side things we could do here. Not that hard. Gotta go way over there. Uh, by accessing Citadel transit terminals like this one, fast travel. <coughs> I'd rather not. Not right now, anyway. <clears throat> Welcome, I am Nalina. I don't recognize you as one of our expected clients today. Would you like me to see when the consort will be able to meet with you? Can't I just go in? Mm, I'm afraid not. Yeah, you must understand there are many who seek the consort services. <laughs> but if you wish to leave your name, she'll make every effort to meet with you. Commander Shepard, with the Alliance Navy. Excellent. You should hear something in... Um, three or four months. <laughs> Nobody's worth that much of a wait. <laughs> well, that's not for me to judge. I have your name, and you'll be contacted. Is there anything else? I think I'm done here. Oh, well, I hope you'll return again in the future. We always enjoy seeing new clients. Nalina. Yes, Shaira? Send the commander up to see me. I wish to speak with her. Yes, of course, mistress. Hmm. Huh. It appears the consort has taken notice of you. She'd like to meet with you now. Where do I go? Just head upstairs. She'll be waiting for you.
That is close enough, Commander. I've heard a great many things about you since your arrival here in our Citadel. What exactly do you do? <laughs> that depends on your needs. I offer advice to some, comfort to others. Mm -hmm. I have a certain problem that could use your expertise. All right. Maybe I can help. I have a friend, Septimus, a retired Turian general. I won't discuss the details, but he wanted me to be more than I could be. We had a falling out. Now he spends his days in Korra's den, drinking and spreading lies about me. If you would speak to him as a fellow soldier, I believe he will listen to you and let the matter be. What exactly do you want me to tell him? Appeal to his sense of honor. Remind him of his position as a general. If you can convince him to stop spreading lies about me, I would be very grateful. I don't think that was necessary, but whatever. <laughs> now I must ask you to take your leave. I have many. Hey. <clears throat> Back. Your problem. Problem will be fixed. This one reminds me of Moira Brown. Fallout 3. Probably the way she speaks. No, it's not the same gal, but... Uh, where am I going? Probably gotta go that way anyway. Can't do anything about those right now. That's another side quest. <clears throat> uh, that's the shop. Don't need to go there. Yeah. <laughs> Gonna be going there later. Fast travel. What we got? Let's go to the embassies. <clears throat> See sec. Probably one of the easiest ways to get to the wards right now. Okay, so... Let's go talk to the council. 